Hi everyone. We're going to find the derivative, the second derivative of cosine squared x. So this problem is just asking us to find a higher order derivative of a trigonomic function. So we first have f of x equals, and if you want you can write it this way. So for step one, we're going to find the first derivative and we have to use the chain rule. So f prime of x equals, we'll do the chain rule, 2 times the inner function times the derivative of the inner function. Derivative of cosine is negative sine. And then simplify this, and we get negative 2 cosine x sine x. Okay, so the second derivative uh, that we're going to do requires, this is step 2, uh, requires the product rule. So we take the second derivative and you're going to get um, negative 2 times cosine x cosine x minus sine x and then sine x. So I took 2 cosine x and the derivative of sine x. So this is your u and this is your v. And I took the I wrote down cosine x and then took the derivative of sine x. And then I wrote down sine x um, and took the derivative of cosine x. And that gives you the negative there. And then basically, and there's a negative 2 in front here. So now all we have to do is plug in pi. So we get negative 2, and this is cosine squared. So we get cosine squared of pi. And this is minus sine squared of pi. So basically, cosine of pi is just a negative 1, but when you square it, you get 1. So you're just kind of like this. Cosine of pi is 1, and then you square it, or it's negative 1, and negative 1 squared is just 1. And then sine of pi is 0. You square 0, you still get 0. So you get negative 2 times 1, and that just equals negative 2. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.